everyone I'm back <laughs> yes yet again sickness has hit me and um, my voice is still not uh, back to normal you'll notice um, as I talk a little bit uh, I will be like a, a puberty ridden teenager <laughs> but I feel much better than I did over the weekend so, since I was feeling better, and since it's Tuesday, you know where I had to go. Yep, Goodwill for Senior Citizen Tuesday. And uh, I spent like, oh, I knew I was going to forget my receipt, 60, $62, I want to say, thereabouts. But I did get quite a bit and I did get some very cool items. I'm, um, I have my iced tea here because I am going to have to keep my throat um, moist. So anyways, excuse me. I hope that all of you are doing well. Uh, we've had some pretty cold weather the last few days, uh, 17 degrees, 14 degrees, so it's been kind of crappy. I know it's nothing like where Nicole North Garden lives in Minnesota. They're like, you know, minus 50. Um, no thanks. <laughs> no thank you. Uh, this is cold enough for me. But anywho, uh, so let's get into the haul, guys. Okay, um, I'm trying to figure out where the heck to start. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to start with this bag of stuff here so I can put the bag on the floor. And then as I go through my stuff on the table, I can put some of it on the chair. That's what we're going to do. Okay, so. <laughs> this guy is the cutest little thing ever. And I'm tempted, um, I just, I'm going to put him out on my farmhouse bench in my kitchen for winter. He doesn't have any Christmas colors. <laughs> Look at his little boots. He looks like he's got on Uggs. Is he not the cutest thing ever? I only paid two eighty nine, less twenty five percent. He is so cute. He's in excellent shape. He looks brand new. So you know I was grabbing him. You know I can't resist snowmen. I just can't help it. So yep, got him. And he's made by Snowden. So I love him. He's going to sit on my lap just for a few minutes. <laughs> All right. I think I'm going to name him Clarence. I don't know why that name just came to me. So, guys, this is Clarence. All right, there you go, buddy. Have a, have a little seat. Okay, so then they had a card of stuff sitting out there, and I saw these, and I'm like, oh, my God, my daughter will love them. So I snapped a picture of them and I sent it to her. She goes, oh, I like those. Hang on, my bag fell on the floor. So I got her two of these pillows. They're so pretty. They look like, you know, uh, doilies. And they just need to be washed. They're a little, they're not too bad, but they're a little dirty. And I definitely would be washing these. 
The only thing I'm afraid of is that the in inners are going to get all globbed up. So um, what we'll probably do is maybe just wash them by hand and then like let them just put them out flat to dry. If anybody has any suggestions on washing these like fiber filled pillows, please let me know because I don't want to ruin them, but they definitely have to be washed. So got two of those. Those were uh, $2.89 a piece, less 25%. So you can't go wrong. Hi, Binks. Excuse me. Pardon me. Thank you, sir. Okay, let me just stick that over there for a second. Was the day for little stuffed critters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got wired ears. He was only $2.89 as well with the discount. How cute. Beautiful. It's like in perfect condition. It's not, it's not dirty or anything. So, yeah. All right. So, let me put these little, little goodies. Sorry, Clarence. You got to go back in the bag right now. Okay, bud? I'm sorry. All right. I got to make some room here. Pillows, you're going back in there. There you go, Clarence. You get, now you and your buddy can take a nap. You got pillows. Perfect. All right. So, let me tell you something, guys. I'm, I'm done with being sick, okay? I... I shouldn't have gloated because I was telling everybody at work, you know what? Since I quit smoking two and a half years ago, I have not been sick. So guess what? Twice in less than two months, I've been sick. Next time, I'm just going to shut the trap and call it good. Okay. Next up. I always say when you can get your hands on uh, lids for things, pick them up. So there was this set of three Pyrex casserole lids in three graduating sizes. And they've been there. Why have they been there for a while? Why has nobody bought them? Because there was a price tag on them of $15. For three lids. I'm like, yeah, okay, you'll be all right. So the tag, the color today, uh, half price color was purple. So I said, let me see if they're on sale. So I turned them over and the tag was purple and it was still $15. And I'm like, I'm not even paying $7.50 for these lids. So I called the girl over. I said, excuse me. I said, you know, it says $15 for this set of lids. She goes, well, it probably goes with something else. I said, no, it doesn't. I said, these are Pyrex casserole lids, and there are no Pyrex casserole dishes anywhere around. I said, and $15 seems pretty steep for three lids. She goes, well, let me go in the back and, and check with my boss. So she took them with her and she came out. She says, how's 349 sound for all three? I said, bingo, that'll do just fine. So 349 and then 25% off of that. Heck yeah. And I have a little um, uh, Pyrex spring blossom casserole dish that doesn't have a lid, now it does. It fits perfect. Woohoo! So, chalk one up for me. Um, I'm gonna pause just for a second, guys, because I still got that dang runny nose and I need to go grab me a Kleenex. Be right back. I am back and I brought one extra just in case. Okay. So, got the Pyrex lids, 
I saw this set of plates and I knew right away that I had to get them for my friend. Uh, they were um, half price. They were regular $5.49. So I paid what, $275? $275? I don't know. But anyways, there are these set of apple dishes. There's this one. This one. And this one. And I just thought they were so pretty. Years ago, um, when my daughter was just a baby, I used to have um, the whole apple theme going on in my kitchen. Sorry about the voice, guys. <clears throat> okay. Um, but anyways, um, so I, for $2.75 for three plates, you can't beat it. And um, I got them for a friend. She knows who she is. Um, I saw this and I definitely, I had to get it. It's, <laughs> I saw like a teenage boy. Um, so I, <laughs> OMG, I got this for resale because I really thought it was, um, so pretty and it's made by St. Nicholas Square. And it's just this beautiful little decorative plate. I'm sure you could use it um, for food because it says uh, dishwasher safe and microwave proof. Uh, make it hot in the microwave. Um, it doesn't say, but I'm sure if you can put it in the microwave, you're going to have food on it. So, um, I mean, I'm sure that you could use it for really anything, but it's so pretty. So, um, I'm thinking of resale for it. I don't know. I might be able to get like maybe 15 bucks for it. I love it. Um, picked this up for a friend. This was uh, $3.49 half off. How cute is that? Love the colors. Very, very cute. I picked this up with the intentions of uh, reselling. However, I'm probably going to keep it. <laughs> now you know why. I absolutely love this. I love the colors. I just cannot bear the part. <laughs> to part with it. It was only $2.49, uh, 25% off. It's made by Max Sarah, hand painted. So um, yeah, now I just gotta find some place to put it. <laughs> Please do not fall. Okay. Um, before my, my throat starts going again, let me take another sip. Bought this because my girl Joanne at A Work in Progress makes these awesome displays using old clocks. She takes the inners out and she makes little scenes inside. And they're so stinking cute. So this was $3.49, 25% off. And I thought, I'm going to give it a shot. Not sure what I'm going to put inside of it yet, but um, we'll see. I mean, it's not like I don't have enough stuff that I can to pick from to put in here. So, you know, we'll see. It should... Uh, it is a cool clock though, isn't it? I love it. 
It was made in China. But anyways, yeah. So that's what I got that for. Stay there. Okay. Um, I saw this on Pinterest and I bought one of these. However, I want, I'm going to hang it this way. And I can't remember exactly what it was that they hung on here. Um, I have to go back and look again because I know I saved it on my Pinterest. But I had been looking for one of these. So I finally found one. So I grabbed it. If I remember and I find the, the picture on Pinterest, I will um, insert it in the video someplace and show you exactly what I intend to do with this. And hopefully not get my fingers stuck in there. Okay. Um, this next item is absolutely beautiful. And it's old. I paid $5.49, 25% off. Look at this gorgeous crucifix. It has that, the inlaid, it looks like it's that yellow, I forget what it's called. And look, oh, look, I didn't even open it. This, he comes off and there are, this has holy water and candles in it. Wow, that's awesome. I did not know that. Now I got to see if I can get it back. Hello. What? There, there we go. Okay. And then he slides back on. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? I don't know if you guys remember, but quite a while back at an estate sale, I got this um, Bible. And the, the cover of the Bible was done in this. And I cannot remember what they call it. So if you guys wouldn't mind refreshing my memory, any of you that know, um, let me know. But this is just gorgeous. And I am keeping this. This is for me. Okay, I know you guys remember a while back, I had thrifted some of the vintage green, the, the turquoise green um, inserts for my drawer, you know, the, the silverware holders. But the, you know what? They're just not, they're not cutting it. Um, so I, I'll probably just take them out and um, resell them. Uh, because I have way too much cutlery and knives and whatnot. So they're not really big enough for me. They're, but there's nothing wrong with them. They're just not, they're not a, a good fit for me and what I have. So I found this. And this is a really nice size one. And it's, uh, it's made by um, M.I.M. I am made smart, but anyways, it's a nice, it, uh, heavy plastic. It reminds me of something like Rubbermaid. So I grabbed this. This was uh, $3.49, less 25% off. So this is for me as well. These are the items that I wanted to put over here, and I'm putting the wrong stuff. Okay, this next item has to be one of my favorite items because I've, sorry guys. Oh, I have never seen um, anything like this before. And I, oh my God, I love this. Have you guys ever seen a shelf like this before? Tell me. 
That is not the coolest thing ever. I absolutely love this and I cannot wait to hang it in my living room. Um, if you recall, I bought those two little shelves that were shaped like houses and had all the little um, niches in there for little tiny tchotchkes. So I hung one up. Oops. Relax. Relax. Okay. Relax. And my daughter wanted the other one. <laughs> so I gave it to her. So now I can hang this on the other side of my couch. And um, I didn't care how much this was. I was buying it anyways. Um, actually, there wasn't even a price on it. So I don't know what the heck she charged. it. I'm sure it couldn't have been more than $349. So love it. Tell me that is not cool. Oh, look, and it's got the little pegs too. This is phenomenal. I am so sorry, you guys. <laughs> You're just going to have to bear with me. Okay. Um, one of the other favorite things that I found today. Well, I had a lot of favorite things, but. I love this. It was only 89 cents minus 25%. And it's the old plastic. I, you know, I'm sorry, but these look more real than, I mean, than the faux, you know, the silk. They really, really do. I just love it. There we go. Alrighty, um, way do you guys see this cup? Can we say 1960? Yep, somebody better call that girl because someone stole her coffee cup. I tried to see if they had any more I looked on every shelf. I could not find any more except this one. I absolutely love this cup. A buck 50, less 25, had to get it. Tell me that is not awesome. Okay, so the full plastic leaves are like digging into my skull. So you can go over here. All right, then I found this, but I only found one, but I just thought it was so cool. I had to pick it up, 89 cents, you know, minus 25%. It is this Oklahoma cup. It has all these pictures on there. There's a Native American and uh, who is that? Who the heck is that? I can't even read that. That's how sh I was almost swore how crappy these glasses are. I have no idea what that says. But anyway, so there's some dude <laughs> over there. And then we have a, a bird. It's probably Oklahoma State bird. And I just thought, I loved the turquoise and the gold. So um, I'm probably going to resell it. I don't know if anybody will buy it, but I'll throw it up there. If nobody buys it, I'll keep it. Got this for a friend. Uh, this London cup has some nice pictures on there of Big Ben, I'm thinking that is. And it has, she could write whatever she wants on there. Um, yeah, so I grabbed that. This is made by Crofton. And uh, 
There was no price on there either, so I'm hoping they charged me like 89 cents like the rest of the coffee cups. I don't know. Um, okay. This little guy. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's terrible. Um, when Nicole North Garden sees this little bunny, she's going to flip her lid. Look at him. I'm showing you close up because he looks like he is like crocheted. See that pattern on there? How adorable is this bunny? So his his ticket said three pieces five forty nine. I only could find one other bunny, this little girl bunny, and there was not a third piece. So I got both for three forty nine, with twenty five percent off. So I grabbed them, but I really only wanted this little guy. You could see why. I mean, why? Oh, my gosh. Adorable. Um, let me get this out of the way. My very first globe. Yay! And this globe is going to go <laughs> on my antique desk in my living room. No, I have not cleaned all the gum off the bottom yet. That will be a summer project because I'm going to do it outside, not in my house. Yeah. So for now, it just sits there and I do not touch anything under there. Under, no. So, but this will go on my desk. And this was... uh I paid regular price for this. It was $5.39 and then 25% off. So I love the color of this globe. I absolutely love it. It's got the nice wood bottom. I know you guys are probably saying, would you please stop talking? <sighs> Then, I'm going to save this for last because it's just like so friggin' cool. Then I found this adorable, it's made by Link, Lincolnshire, this little snowman. He's the colors of like my Lennox stuff. So I had to get him. He's missing his little gemstone in his belly, but look how cute he is. He is just adorable. Holds a tea light, let it snow, he says, but look at his face. How cute is he? And he was only, he was a half price item, $349, 50% off. So. So I grabbed him and he's like, he's part like a matte finish and part shiny. Oh, here's his other little thing. Look, it's stuck on, how the heck did that happen? How the heck does that happen? It's stuck in between the bubble wrap. Whatever, at least it's not gonna get lost. All right, so grab that little guy. Um, I also grabbed, this is for a friend as well. Um, it was the two pieces for $3.49, 25% off. Look at, oh wait. How pretty are these? No chips, no cracks. These stickers on the other side, but 
It's a gorgeous, gorgeous shade of blue. It's like a green blue. It's, I, it's really hard to tell in this lighting, but just beautiful. A little creamer and sugar. No chips or cracks. I was like, oh my God, I can't believe it. So I got that. I got this for myself. Um, it does have a chip, which I will touch up with some paint. There's the chip right there, but it's Dracula. He's so cute. This is a hand-painted ceramic piece. This was half price. It was uh, $349, 50% off. And it's got a little battery thing here because his eyes, I guess, are supposed to light up. So when it comes more close to... Um, uh, Halloween I will see if I can pop that off and put a new battery in there but I loved that I thought it was so cute time for another sippy sip now this was a half price item as well it was $5.49 50% off that's the only reason I bought it because I know it's missing its lid because I did sell one of these to one of my, my friends out there. You know who you are. Um, but I figured I would get it for myself and I'll use it. Because it's, like I said, it's missing the lid. But it was this beautiful green depression glass. Um, I, I want to say it was like, um, it might have been like a little casserole dish or something. It had a lid. And, um... I, I had seen it sitting there, and I'm like, oh, it's missing the lid. So when it went half off, I said, I'll get it for myself. And it does have, you know, some little, like, flea bites up here. You can see them. There's a, a couple little chips along the inside rim. So, I mean, that's why I'm going to keep it for, for myself. And, um... I'm not sure what I'm going to use it for. I haven't um, thought about it, but I knew, like, you know, for that price, I was going to grab it. So, um, we're almost done, you guys. I got this real cute little figurine, and it has the... Um, The, um, yeah. I know the name of these dogs. Um, they were very popular back in the, I think it was the 30s and the 40s or whatever. Scotties, Scottish Terriers. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. This cold has gotten to my brain. Oh my God, sorry guys. <laughs> um, it, did, it did have a sticker on the bottom. I, I believe it was made in Japan. There's part of the sticker that's left. It's red and silver. So um, it wasn't uh, too expensive. I don't remember what it was because I took the tag off. I want to say it was $239 with 25% off. Might have been less than that. But anyways, so I just thought it was really cute. That'll probably go in, you know, for resale. I don't know. I might be able to get $10 for it. And uh, I just want to make sure I'm not forgetting anything. I don't think I am. Maybe if I talk really loud, my, no, that's not going to help. Okay, this piece is really beautiful. Um, let me just double check before I show you. It was not on sale, but it was 25% off. And this was made in Italy. Um, and on the bottom it has, it was 
I did, did I say it was 549? Let me take this stupid sticker off. You know, can, it, can I just get a sticker off without it sticking to me? I guess not. Anyways, I'm trying to see the whole name on here. Hello? Get off. Um, La Palm Sesto. La Palm Sesto F. Made in Italy. And it is this gorgeous footed dish. Probably like a candy dish, I would think. It's beautiful. Let me turn it this way so you can see. That's the lid. It's just stunning. Um, it does have, a, you know, some paint loss. And it's mostly, it's mostly on the, the little squiggly, uh, swirly things there. But it's not really too bad. I saw that and I'm like, wow, that is really, at first I thought it was going to say like Capa de Monte on it, but then I'm like, no, whoops, <laughs> sorry. It doesn't have any flowers, you know, like, so, but I had to pick that up. I just really, I think it's just gorgeous. It needs to be cleaned up. Um... It does have, it looks like superficial little, um, little like fractures, but superficial. It doesn't go all the way through to the other side, and it's just on this one. So, I had to grab that, and I just thought it was so pretty. So, there we go, guys. I think that's everything. So as I said, I spent like 60, 60 some dollars. I can't remember the exact amount. I don't want to have to stop the video to go and get the receipt out of my purse. But um, for the amount of items that I got, I did not think I did too badly, really. Um, I do have friend mail, but I am going to save that for another video because I'm already um, 27 minutes into this video. And I have, uh, I have two boxes from my friend Larry. And I have a small package from my friend Maria. So I'm just going to wait until um, my next video to uh, share those things with you. Um, what else was I going to tell you guys? I can't even think. I am so sorry about my voice. Oh my God. <clears throat> it's just getting worse. Um, I guess I just want to say that um, I, <laughs> I sent out a bunch of thank you cards today to my friends out there that sent me some wonderful uh, Christmas gifts and things. And um, so I did get that done. And while I was out sick, uh, I was laying in bed and I took advantage of the fact that um, I was laying in the bed doing nothing. So I got more things listed. Um, I did all my thank you cards. And... Uh, I guess that's it. Um, I would like to thank all of my um, new subscribers and just say welcome. Um, I'm glad you um, became part of my uh, crazy family here. We have a lot of fun. Um, so I'm glad to have um, all of my new uh, friends. And uh, of course, love all of my um, old friends too. Uh, no pun intended. <laughs> so, guys, I guess I will um, 
give you a break from this disgusting voice. <laughs> it's almost like, you know, nails on a chalkboard. So I do apologize, but I wanted to get this haul video up for all of you. And um, to tell you the truth, I was I was missing not doing my, my haul videos. I, I didn't go out of my house at all this weekend. I just was home in the bed and I didn't peek my nose out the door until today when I went to work. So um, with that being said, thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.